All right, in order for me to compensate for my really crappy um, fighting in FA18 with only guns, I, th I decided to jump back to an older game, which requires me to use guns only. And, um, and maybe a, a rocket at one point. So, this is the game, Heroes of the Pacific. My a very, very good game, which I've raged in in the past. Why... Wait, why is there no sound still? God damn, not this shit again. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Okay, here, let's see. Oh, there we go. Alright, now we got sound again. Alright. I'll do my the opening uh, intro. See what she, what happens. <sighs> this game is very difficult. Unlike the uh, Europe one, this one. Well, ow. Uh, this one, we'll divine a little bit. Requires you to lead the target. Yeah, so she requires you Cartoon cartoon show. Uh, my brain's sleep fried right now. Okay. Let's jump right into it. My name's William Crow. I'm a pilot in the U.S. Navy. My oh, dad my. used to be a pilot in the United States Air Force, so growing up we moved around a lot. New towns, new schools, new friends. Dad used to take my kid brother Charlie and me to the airbase at whatever town we lived in at the time. Every year there'd be new planes, new models. Every year they were faster and stronger, each one better than the one before. Then there was the accident. Some pilot screwed his landing and crashed. Dad was working in the hangar. He ran out and pulled the pilot from the burning plane right before it went up. Dad was badly burned. He was lucky to be alive, but he couldn't fly anymore. He got a discharge and a pension. Well, the pension was never enough, and pretty soon we found ourselves farming a patch of dirt just to get by. Out there, the only things we had plenty of were dirt and sky. Our only entertainment was a busted old crop duster, so Charlie and I became the Dirt Duster Brothers. We flew the wings off that old crate. As much fun as that was, it couldn't last forever. The Navy was our way out. When we got old enough, we joined up. I graduated from flight training at Pensacola. Charlie trained as a sailor. Before long, we got our postings. I was stationed at Hickam Field, Pearl Harbor. Charlie was on the USS Arizona. 
a great name for a great battleship, the pride of the fleet. Fun fact, they messed up in the game here. There was no Air Force in the 1940s. It was the Air Corps. <sighs> That's the main thing. So, <laughs> they screw up right there. It's the only real mess up I've seen. History note, they changed it uh, soon after World War II to Air Force and Tyler Little Branch is an Air Corps. We've been caught off guard by a Japanese surprise attack. You must take off at once to avoid being destroyed on the ground by their attack planes. Once airborne, you must defend the planes still on the ground and our vital fueling facilities. If you fail, our fleet will be severely hampered in their ability to strike back after this vicious attack. It seems the war has finally begun, Lieutenant Crow. Pearl Harbor was hell. One minute I was thinking about getting out of bed, the next minute the sky's so thick with planes I could barely see the sun. The shark's mouth made famous by the flying tigers over in China. I can't remember his name. Why well, can't remember his name? Yeah, the term flying tigers came from the Chinese when they saw the plane, the um, mercenary group from the U.S. They, they, they said they were Fighting like tigers, flying tigers, and the name stuck. Look them up. They were, they were the most, they were the strangest group of mercenaries, uh, soldiers you'll ever see in your life. They had a pet tiger. That case closed. That's it. <coughs> mm -hmm. All right, loading. Wow. 